Hey there and welcome to another exciting project. Today we're going to dive into the fascinating world of HTML5 audio. Our mission to build a fun and interactive soundboard where each button triggers a different sound effect. Imagine this you click a button and a sound effect plays instantly. If another sound is already going and you press a different button, the current sound will stop and the new one will start. Cool, right? We'll be using the HTML5 audio tag to bring our soundboard to life, but instead of relying on the default controls, we're taking full control through JavaScript. You'll see how we capture audio elements and manage playback with methods like play and pause. If you want to delve deeper into these methods, feel free to check out the HTML5 audio documentation. This project is simple yet incredibly hands-on, giving you a great way to experiment with audio elements. And don't forget, this is the ninth project in our 100 Projects in 100 Days Challenge. Be sure to check out our playlist and hit that subscribe button to follow along with all our creative projects. Let's get started and make some noise. Okay, so we're going to start on our soundboard and there's actually not a lot of code for this project so we can most likely get this done in one video. Let's call this project soundboard. In the HTML, we're going to use the HTML5 audio tag. Let's say audio enter and we need a source that comes from the sounds folder. I have a folder called sounds with various sound files like applause.mp3. You can get these from the GitHub repository or the live demo. Right click to download the sound or use your own. I'll point to that folder and specify applause.mp3. I'm also giving it an ID of applause. Now let's copy this down for multiple sounds. Copy the audio tag six times and update each sound source and ID accordingly.
button is clicked, we want to play the corresponding sound. We can do this using the HTML5 audio API's play method. Avoid overlapping sounds, we'll create a function called stop songs. This function will pause all playing sounds and reset their current time to zero. Add the stop songs function to our script, which pauses and resets each sound. HTML5 audio API. There are many cool things you can do with it, like creating a full audio player. This project is a great introduction. Hope you enjoyed it. Let's move on to the next project. Can't seem to find a light between the walls I built for my 